through the womb of hopelessness, not knowing what tomorrow has yeah. in store. You're here. Mm -hmm. I've been calling you. I've been looking for you. Mm -hmm. Sorry, what's it? <coughs> Hope no problems. No. Master. Yeah? The Holy Spirit has been speaking to me about pastor's preaching last week. What is it about pastor preaching? Ah, have you forgotten? Um, yeah, but can you remind me please. Evangelism now. Oh, that's true. Yes. Evangelism. So what is it about evangelism? Yeah, the Holy Spirit has been speaking to me to go out there to evangelize to our neighbors. Preach the gospel, tell them about God, win souls for Christ. Let's go, please. Um, definitely not today. Can we do that tomorrow? Because I have an appointment by 3 o'clock. Martha, why? The last time, that was what you said. Always having an appointment. Just one hour. You know it's our duty to win souls for Christ as Christians. Let's do this. Mary, tomorrow, not today, please. Martha, just one hour. Just one hour? Yes. One hour? Yes. All right. Martha, let's go. See her face. Mm -hmm. Pastor M. So in the house. Sure that house is so beautiful. You know what? I know very soon. I'm going to own that big house. Of course you will. Just focus. Let's go. We are going from the And you're talking about. Um, <gasps> Maybe see that one. See that car. Go. This is my dream car. <laughs> Mata, let's go. Mother, hmm? the spirit of God say you should visit this house. Hi. Mary, are you blind? Can't you see that house? This house is so beautiful. Huh? I'm sure the you know this house doesn't even need God. So because the house is big, that does that mean that the person in it knows God or does that mean that the person inside the house is happy? Look. If I'm the one that is living in this house, trust me, I don't need God. I'll be so comfortable and be walking around. Are you and besides, the owner of this house should be the one evangelizing to us and not we. Please, let's go. Let's look for another house. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Do you think it's about house, money, or anything? No. If you don't have God, you don't have anything. You don't. <sighs> Let's go. The Spirit of God says we should go. And don't be surprised. The person living in this house might not be happy. Let's go. Let's go. E! Take it easy. Oh. You see? I told you, the person living inside this house does not need God. Please, let's go before you call police on us. Calm down. I'm very sure. Maybe I don't want any trouble. Please, let's go. Excuse me, ladies. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Um, my name is Mary and this is my sister, Martha. Um, if you don't mind, we just want to share the word of God with you. I'm sure you, you can come. Thank you. Martha. Oh. Um, sir, I'm so sorry to disturb you, but we've just been led by God to, to come here. So I want to talk to you about God's love. God loves you so much. No matter what you're going through, no matter your condition, no matter what life throws at you, no matter the situation you are right now, He loves you <laughs> so much. Uh, um, about that, I mean, I believe I'm loved. I, I, I throw parties every weekend. People come here 
My friends call me Jagaban. Like, what are you talking about? Sir, I, I understand, but it's a different love. It's an unconditional love. Your friends come here to celebrate with you because of what you have, sir. But this God loves you regardless of anything. If you don't have anything, he loves you. Okay. He gave his only begotten son for you and I. <laughs> uh, this love, does it come with peace and happiness? Because trust me, I, like I said, I'm doing quite all right. But yeah, minus the fact that I don't have a wife or kids. But I want to believe I'm doing very well, but uh, it's just... Sir, you mean you don't have a wife, uh, a kid, not even a girlfriend? And you live in this house all by yourself? Sir, let me pray for you. In Jesus' name, before the end of this week, mm. you will locate your wife. Amen. In fact, your wife will locate you. Amen. 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 Sir, what shall it profit a man to have the old word and lose the soul? You just, it's about the salvation of the soul. Just believe, accept him, take him in, and you will have peace. You will have everything before this week, before the end of this week. You have everything. I don't know why I'm even saying all this, because I don't know you guys from anywhere, but in all sincerity, I've been trying to find peace and genuine happiness. Mm. And all has been to no avail. You know what, sir? The Bible says, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and everything will come in. Yes. Let us pray. Let's join our faith together. Yes, let's pray. In Jesus' name. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I